Jeff Jarrett. Referee Jerry Calhoun, I do not envy his task here as he has to keep these guys separated. Boy, Goliath, what a huge guy. I'm continually impressed by his size. He's about 6'8", six, 6'9", six, and weighs in at 417 pounds by his lonesome. What are you supposed to have for breakfast? Who's going to start, Goliath or King Carl? It's going to be Jeff Jarrett, definitely, for his team. And it's going to be King Carl Fergie. Fergie against ah, Jeff on, Jarrett. Jeff. Carl got a Pearl Harbor shot there. <laughs> From Billy Travis as he went by. Yes, yeah. indeed. Good boy, Billy. Boy, you don't want to mess around with Jarrett and Travis, I tell you. As you mentioned, they're giving away a lot of weight. That's about all they're giving away here. Billy, uh, Billy always wants us to say hi to his mom up in Lexington, Kentucky. He's doing fine. Carl Fergie, he's doing fine, too, if you consider choking Jeff Jarrett doing fine. He had his hand wrapped right around his throat. Jarrett, with a reversal, puts him into the rope, lets him go by. He goes under again. Jeff picks him up. Nice body slam by Jeff Jarrett. Fergie knocked through the rope down to the floor. Lyon is screaming. He had to do something illegal there, he says. Crowd getting behind Jeff Jarrett and Billy Travis. Expiration of time match. Right, We're about a minute and a half in. Goliath's not going in there. I want to see Jeff Jarrett body slam Goliath. Okay. I... <laughs> Here we go. King Carl going back to the counting house there. Carl's had a rough day already. Andrew has. He sure enough has. Oh, it's interesting with Carl and Jeff in here against each other. They got a big wheel of torture match coming up. Special stipulations on that one. If Jeff loses that match, he has two dozen eggs thrown in his face. If Fergie loses it, he has to run through a 20-man belt line. Big Goliath in there, though. And King Wait. Carl now steps in and says, uh, Goliath. Boy, what do you call that uh, move, Dave? <laughs> not sure. I'm not either. <laughs> Carl was telling him to remain calm. Yeah, remain calm. Easy for him to say, huh? Jeff Jarrett, back for a mini conference with Billy Travis in the corner. Jeff makes the tag. Billy Travis climbs the ropes. He's on the middle when King Carl goes wandering in to the referee. That worked to his disadvantage, though, as Billy was able to hammer Goliath coming off the rope. Billy just leapfrogs over him. Oh, he's got a quiet body slam. Uh-uh. You're a good man, Billy, but I don't know if you're going to be able to do that or not. 417 pounds worth, the mighty Goliath. Big hammer across the back, a telephone pole. A boot to the midsection. King Carl Fergie with a right fist flying. Three minutes gone in the fall. Uh-oh. Oh, good. great move. Moved out of the way. Jarrett. Jeff Jarrett battling both of them. They pop their heads together. Jeff with the right hand. King Carl staggered. Oh, oh, the the pinky, prince pinky, is yeah. Get it, Jeff. Get it. Jeff leaves and heads after the prince. Prince is in the ring. Referee doesn't see him. King Carl rolled down. Look yeah. out. Prince is right there. He nails Jeff from behind. Now, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Your body shot. There's qualification. It's going to be 
Jeff and Billy are going to win the fall as the Prince is in the ring. They're going to Prince up on the rope. Jeff moves out of the way to Prince. Nails King Kong. Yeah, I got it. Three minutes, 52 seconds to time. First Jeff, right. Jarrett, Billy, Travis have themselves a first fall victory. We'll check the time. Be back in a moment. get another fall going on. I, I wish we did, but boy, we had some matches today. The person 